Hello everyone, this is General Oda and welcome back to our Let's Play Rome 2 Total War. So we've advanced a single turn since our last video. And we have our first legion without a general and we'll just assign whoever to it, uh, some veteran legionnaires. And looks like uh, also during our, our uh, advance in the turn, it looks like uh, Odessa was lost to the rebels. And it doesn't look like we can actually get back there in Ready time without uh, being in forced march stance. Waiting for more orders. Uh, these guys. Oh, I guess we could have made it. Damn it! But we can't get out of forced march now, so we'll have to wait another turn before we can take that back. So let's uh, focus on the north really quick. North looks to be pretty good. Ready for uh, we got most of our forces back. Uh, I don't see any places where these guys can take us out, so we'll auto resolve these guys. There's only 32 of them, so we'll kill those dudes. And you'll notice that uh, it's much faster now because because I uh, set the speed a little faster. And by that I really mean that I hit space, and uh, that's why. Okay, so I force march, but couldn't force march. And let's see, ba -ba -ba -ba. got a ship right here. Got the main here. I don't even know if I'm at war with them, so let's check diplomacy. And who are we at war with? Let's see, main. We're not at war with them yet, but they only have like two provinces here, I think. Guerrera is there. Persia is very close by. Where are we? Armenia is right there. Alright, so we'll figure it out as we go. And we own this place. Okay, so we need to march this way doesn't look like there's too many Ready dudes for resisting we take this for Rome. they're very unhappy 18 something dudes oh those guys got destroyed we I, I blinked my eye and the battle was already over that's how ridiculous it was so we got these guys for the temple what is this place Nothing good, but it is a provincial capital, so I guess we'll just convert this to a Roman town. It'll take six turns, basically means six years. We'll get rid of these guys, and we have 109 food. Nice. Very, very nice. This is a different province, and I completely forgot to move these dudes, but we got 160 iron, so we'll continue that trend. Destroy everything in here. And you can hear sirens in the background. Uh, that is why recording at night is a little tougher, just because there's all these sounds going on. Alright, so let us attack Perosilus. What was it called? Per Persepolis. Persepolis, yes. Persepolis. And forces look relatively even. I mean, we do have the 7th Legion with us, so... We should be relatively good. We'll attack in the fog so that they can't see us and we can kind of see them. Ready for orders. Oh, and we got these rebels. I mean, no, wait, we got these mercenaries. So that should be good for us. We'll use them. And I should use my legionnaires to man these ladders. So these guys will regroup too. Oh, way Romans too close. Okay, so let's be smart. So let's be smart about this. Let's not clump them up. Oh man, what's going on? Uh, let's see. I'm trying not to clump them up too much so that uh, at least they have some breathing space. Okay, and then we got these legionnaires here. That will be by themselves in group three. Group five. 
These guys will be group four. They'll be my my killing gladiatorial group. These guys are my super awesome dudes, and they'll be over here. And these guys won't do too much until the gates are breached. So, all right, let's do this. So these guys will go this way. We'll uh, hit the walls. And they should be all fit on this one. Okay, very nice. I don't want to be too close to their gate, so let's do that. Okay. Go like right here. We don't want to be too close. We don't want to get shot. Let's see what they got going on over here. Oh, oh, wrong button. They got uh, some Eastern Javelin men and a bunch of other dudes. But these guys are marching in. I'm actually gonna hit the options really quick. Just want to check something. I've never actually gone through here, so let's go to battle. And there's something that I've always wanted to look for, and that's the cinematic view, which I don't know what the button is. Okay, it's insert. Very nice. Let's see what that does. Let's look for the insert key. Uh, whoa, -ho -ho, look at this. It's crazy. All schnapples. That's very cool. Let's cinematic view this guy. Oh, okay, I keep going back there. What, what does this mean? Oh, I can manual control. I hit spacebar. Nothing's happening. Whoa. Okay, it's uh, kind of strange. Let me go insert these dudes. Oh, yeah. Let's see. Right click to exit. Spacebar to toggle manual control. And I can't do anything. Interesting. Alright. Well. That wasn't as cool as I thought it would be. Oh, no, what's going on? Oh, there we go. Okay, well, we'll cinematic view our way in for these dudes right here. Maybe it'll be really cool, maybe it'll be really bad. But uh, I guess we'll find out now. Alright, Robins, we are marching up uh, with our shields on our backs. We're the Ninja Turtles. We're going up. Enemy's gates have been destroyed. I can see my men on my left and the right. And see these dudes, they're patiently waiting for us. They're not even throwing their javelins. They're just like, alright, I'm ready for you. Now we're standing on top of the ladder. We're gonna jump down. Oh, I'm stuck on I'm stuck. I'm stuck in between the wall and the ladder. But I can see my men fighting. So now I'm slowly approaching the wall. And uh hopefully we'll see something cool happen. I'm gonna zoom in and you see the combat. You can see the brilliance of my soldiers fighting and the, 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 the fear on our enemy's eyes. And uh, these guys are just cheering. I mean, you can see those, dude, those dudes jumping in. They're just cheering as the enemy is routing, I guess. So, alright. That was very strange. It's not as epic as I thought it would be, but uh, it's cool. So now, oh shit, I, I needed to march those guys in, but I was too busy cinematic viewing my way in. Eastern Spearmen. These guys might be a, provide a good view. They can uh, attack and we'll zoom in, we'll see the enemy. This is like watching a movie, kind of, except Except uh, to in Rome to the war. Awesome cinematic views. And gates, I mean, and flags that keep changing colors. So you see reinforcements coming in, it's like a wave of dudes, and it's actually pretty cool. Very cool looking. Lots of, lots of, lots of troops moving around. And uh, we're losing so many men that uh, we can't really see anything anymore. Not much, not many men behind us. So we're all alone. I'm gonna unzoom. And I was hoping I could do like a 
a, a free look, but it doesn't look like we can. I hit spacebar, and uh, not much is going on. Let's uh, watch this, watch the combat a little bit. Uh, it might be really cool. You can hear the shields getting hit, but uh, you don't really see it. Oh, that guy just got stabbed. Alright, so these uh, legionaries are fighting for their lives against this massive mob of uh, eastern uh, spearmen. So heavy infantry against the uh, light infantry. Alright, so let's get out of here. Because we need to actually do stuff, otherwise our men are all gonna die. So now we are going to march towards this way to take the gate. And yep, just like the closest gate. Uh, there's a further gate on the right side. And actually there's a gate... I, I don't know what that is. Looks like something. So these guys will use the whip. Um, we still see the battle here. These guys are cheering away as per normal. And so we got our men here. Do we got oil? Oh snap, there's no oil. And here I thought I was gonna get burned to death. Turns out I could could have sent my my ja my uh my gladiators a long time ago. So let's send our men out to the front. Let's debate as to whether we want to use our cavalry to break through their forces. And my men are now coming out of the gate. And whoa, nice. The marching is really cool. I I'll have to admit, the charging is very cool. Marching. Oh god, what are you guys doing? No, didn't want you guys to go in there. Now, let's see, what, what are we up against over here? Javelin men. Alright, looks like a time. Looks like a job for real cavalry. Uh, so these guys will be group 9. We'll charge. And then we'll get ready with the tr uh, trample. So this should be really cool. So now we will. We will cinematic view our way through to victory. Oh, oh, we're stuck. We got stuck. What are you guys doing? Come on. Come on. It was supposed to be very, very epic. Alright, so let's try it again. Double click. I am not in a good spot. I missed the front charge. I can see them going in, but it wasn't as epic as I would have hoped. So that's perfectly fine. As these dudes are trampling. So they're gonna push forward. My my legionaries need to stop cheering and start fighting. It's getting ridiculous. We've got our mercenary Italian uh, spearmen. Our cavalry is charging through. So now these guys are are cheering. Um, they're cheering their way through. That's how you do it. That's how you do it in this game. You cheer through and you win. Win battles. That's how you win. If you're not cheering, you're not winning. And so we are... We need to keep going. Come on. Come on, guys. Now because I can, I'm just gonna send in the rest of my gladiators to provide support and to basically help charge through. Come on, men. You can do it. We can charge through this gate like nobody's business. And looks like they're... Aw, oh, man! It looks like they're routing now. Aw, oh, that sucks. I was hoping they'd uh, put down a fight, uh, like a fight to the death, so that we could, uh, you know, at least have something past the gate. That would be more interesting. But Sextus Marcellus has done the Romans proud. 236 losses and killed over 2,000, so it's pretty good. Killed off the rebels. They cowered away the moment they saw us. So level whoa, whoa, what's this going on? Okay, level two, and we'll get a consecrated ground, a farm, and a consecrated ground. 
Persepolis is a capital, so we'll keep it the way. Ooh, what's this? Exotic animal studs, but with no exotic animals. So Persis, I think, is Persia. Yeah, How no, maybe. Yeah, I don't know. We'll uh, keep going to the right. Gore. Gore. At your command. So Persia is in our state. I don't like this. We hunger for but the uh, second Victory legion will take care of the rebels Rome. first. Uh, these guys will now run away Destroy as usual. Them. So we'll get rid of them. What? 87%? Damn it. Should have not auto resolved that, but that's okay. So the dudes are dead. We'll execute Nice Pacentius is at your command. Winner. We hunger for battle. And so we'll give him Ooh, more public order. Because why not? Alright. Oh, okay, we've marched We've marched our feet out of this one. Parfava, let's see. What do they got? They got two settlements and they're at war with everyone else. Eh. We're just going to attack. My sword is yours. On the move. None will escape. Uh these dudes are so depleted, we're just gonna quickly finish them off. Uh, quick stab to the face. That guy decided to uh, pretend to be dead, so he dropped dead. Quintus Ignatius Postumus. Postumus. So that faction is now actually gone. So, so we took care of them. We got some textiles out of it. Destroy everything. This is Aria. I think. I think that's how you pronounce it. Lots of rebels. This is pretty crazy. There's a lot of rebels. A lot of, like most of these places are rebellions. Huh. Well, we'll spread some Rome, and hopefully there won't be as many rebels. Now let's see. What do we got here? Ah, so we got our elephants. Ho ho ho! Auxiliary African elephants. That's that's awesome. I hope. Uh, we can have a battle there soon. And looks like we can At your command. Yep, looks like we can end the turn. So looks like we got some forces here that are attacking us, but we'll just auto resolve. At Adumatu. I think these are rebels. And rebels, well auto resolving should do us well. And we'll kill off these rebels. And not bad, only run rebellion that whole turn. Uh, we'll have Apicinius Macur. Ah, uh, Quintus Ignatius Postumus is dead. The guy sounds really familiar. I feel like we talked about him literally the last turn. So these guys go back to none. And we will keep our we guys back here. They were they will replenish their forces. Your orders. Uh, no mercenaries, so we'll just get some <coughs> additional levies. Or we could have marched all the way, sailed all the way back, but uh, that's that's too much work. Anyways, I see the emperor, Lucius. Lucius Navius something. It is an honor to is serve this guy? Rome. Yep, he's an admiral. Oh, that sucks. Yeah. Not good. Get rid of all of these levies. Since he is the emperor, he'll get some uh, more legionnaires, some more assault bearmies. Oh. Interesting, these are guys are like about the same thing. And I guess that'll be it for now. I guess we kinda needed those levies. Damn it. Y you always need a little bit of levies. Okay, well that's that. Uh 
Got some, got me self some African, some African uh, elephants. At your command. Oh man. At ease, men. March until uh, force march my way please. off of the. Yeah, yeah. All hands to the oars. So we're gonna attack this place with elephants, and hopefully they can meet up with the rest of my legions. But Caesar works alone, Commander. for now. Laying siege to the Second Legion will go up there, and while they're marching, we'll build a temple, and we'll build another temple. Build a farm here. At your command. Not even sure if we're at War of Persia or not, but uh, I think we will be soon. Now let's see, Grove and Mars. This will be one of these dudes. Wow, I did not notice that we conquered this much. Public forums. So if you can build a farm, by all means build a villa. Uh, if you're really desperate for food, then you can build like the ca the meadows, but uh, I don't recommend it. But up to you if you do play this game. If you don't, well then, you know, continue enjoying, enjoying this Let's Play. So, we got armies Commander. everywhere, and I don't know where to put them. Sargartua. Uh, I think I'll march this way. At once. Commander. Sousa will, will go this way, I guess. None will escape. We will trespass, but at the same time we will also take a new Rome. settlement. And because, ooh, man, we are actually very dangerously low on time. So let's uh, encircle this for now. And we'll continue to plan our next steps. And then we'll probably fight in the next video. Commander. And what province is this? Uh, let's see. It's so hard to see. But uh, no, we cannot reach the settlement. So I guess we'll reach... Well, we can't reach this settlement either, so... Kind of in a pickle. And uh, I guess we'll march here. Ready for orders. This is a... Uh, kind of a middle ground with Your no death. Uh, this place has no On death either, move. so... Put them there here. And... Da -da 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 -da. What else have we got? So we positioned our armies in places where we're going to strike next. Uh, I don't remember if this place we can go further up. Yes, we can. Okay, so this veteran is uh, in the freezing cold. As you command. Now have a march up a little bit to see what's... Oh, Scythia. Pausing to hone my so I can... I think uh, you see like these lines up here. I think these are the borders. That will probably be released in future DLC where the Huns probably or the Mongols decide to say, hey, we're gonna burn everything down. That's probably what's gonna happen. At least, that's my assumption. Okay, so, uh, looks like we're out of time here. Uh, thank you guys all for watching.